Hi, this is Kyle with another Google Sites tutorial. This one is going to be helping administrators, site administrators, uh, to manage their site using the sharing permissions in Google Sites. All right, let's go into the share button. In the top right, big blue button, I always call it share. And we're going to be tackling page level permissions. So we might be quite familiar with the, uh, the normal permissions. You know, you add an email here and you get them started with editor, owner, viewer. But um, page level permissions are a little bit different, a little bit more uh, micromanagement in terms of who has access to what pages. So let's enable that. I'll give you a little warning and a getting started guide. I recommend uh, reading that. Let's turn it on. Okay, so you'll notice now that we have a sidebar with every page in the Google site. So we can like lock down a page or a, a branch of pages um, simply by clicking on this change button up here. And we're gonna use custom permissions. And this is a, two options here, add new users. As you add them, they'll be added to this new branch you're creating or don't add them, which makes it kind of more independent and you can control it more easily, I'd say. I always, pretty much always go with do not add new users. So let's go with that, hit save. Okay, so let's imagine that you just want this to be managed by project managers or something. So I would need to invite them first at the site level. That's an important step because it won't let you do that unless you first add them at the site level, the top level. So I'm gonna add Kyle at, um, or I'll add admin at sitestemplate.net. Uh, I'll make him a, an editor and notify him. All right, no, I won't. Okay, so I'm just gonna share that to him. So now here on this page, I'm now given the option to designate him as either an editor or a viewer of that new branch that we created. So I'll, I'll go ahead and make him an editor and I'll hit save. So now I've created this new little area where just, or I can even make it private. So just me and just Kyle and uh, just certain people can access this page and all sub pages under it. Uh, so it's kind of locked down and so you can create these uh, sections for different employees or different groups, which is where, really where you get the power of Google Sites for an intranet because you can, you can do that. So, uh, just a quick tutorial on page level permissions. Thanks for tuning in.